Uh, this is gonna sound like a really stupid question, but how good do you think you could do an impression of Milo Yiannopoulos? No. Fair I, I would. <laughs> yeah, I'll no, do my I best don't. Darling. But... Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'll try to do Popeye because I think that's gonna be a bit easier. I got, 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 got. I got fresh air. After being cooped up in there for so long, I can really use some outdoor exercise. My name is Muscar Mario. I must thank you for saving me. Now it's my turn to help you. Behold. Uh, he gives us Chill Out, which is an ability that lowers attack. Call me whenever you find yourself in trouble. I'll always come quickly to aid you in battle. Now, I'm going back to my dear old star, Heyman. I ate a frog this morning. Mario! 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 I have news! News from the castle! Oh my god. <gasps> Honorable Star Spirit! Hi. Hmm. I believe you are Twink. You're that youngster who recently ascended from Starborn Valley up to Star Haven. What? You remember my name? That's that's kind of creepy, man. I'm like two. Wait, you're two? With that voice, I would have assumed you're at least like <laughs> twelve. <laughs> ah, ah, stranger danger. such a fuss, lad. I'm sure you'll go on to do great things. Unlike Old Star, who just complains about potato salad, but that's just him. I must take my leave now. Later, f bye, Felicia! Having fun? Much. <laughs> wow! I talked to the muscular, the honorable star spirit. I rarely have such a chance, even at Star Haven. I'm shaking, even though my sprite doesn't look any different from normal. Oops! I'm sorry. I have some important news from the castle. According to the information Princess Peach, I mean, I got, it seems like one of the honorable star spirits is being held at Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. What? I'm excuse me? Lava Lava redundantly. You won't believe what the princess went through to get this information. She had to bake a cake for a fucking fat ass! I hope it was a huge help! I mean, honestly, the guy had, like, huge man tits and everything! I'm going back to rejoin Princess Peach! Hopefully we don't have to bake another cake! Good luck, Mario, you, you fucking fat ass! The princess and I will keep looking for useful information. Normally, we would have to go back to Toe Town, but since we're already in Toe Town. I think we should return the dictionary. So, Radomir. Yes? 
I literally just said this to the audience, but usually we would have to make our way... What? Yeah. Usually we would have to make our way all the way back to Toe Town, but since we're already in Toe Town, I figured there's a couple of things that we could do. We could give the chef this cookbook for once. Yes. We'll give Nerdy Boy his dictionary back. Yes. Is that it? Uh... Probably. Interesting. That's a... Perfectly timed chair squeak. Yep. Sorry. This guy there is losing go. IQ points from not having a dictionary. Meanwhile, he has all these other fucking books. I know this is going to sound, like, really dickish, but you can actually go this entire game without visiting Luigi. Yeah, but Luigi is awesome. Uh, yeah, he also has... His little letters that he writes in the basement are actually kind of funny. Maybe, I'm thinking of doing, like, before we go to defeat Bowser, I was thinking of doing, like, one session where we actually do some unfinished business type stuff. Uh. But yeah, it doesn't look like I can do much anymore. I will say this much, though. Next chapter is probably going to be a long one. But if I can get the guests who I really want on, maybe it maybe it'll be worth it. So, on behalf of Neon Cabaret, I've been the American Slacker. I've been Rodimir. And this has been very entertaining for me. I'm not quite sure how, how entertaining it's going to be for you. Yeah, fair. Radimir is just watching me have fun with myself while he's just doing homework. Yeah, I'm on the verge of punching my computer screen right now. Well, wait till we finish the recording first. <laughs> okay. Good night, fuckers. Good night.